playing the first ever rated Roblox game in the whole of Roblox. So, yes guys, that game is called Meep City for some reason. It is the first ever rated Roblox game. Known to set I don't need that. So, I don't know why they rated it so bad to me when it's actually pretty good. So, here's the water, here's a lake. I literally got a fidget spin a wee. And right now, you can literally spawn into the neighborhood. So, you can choose what kind. Big grassy, small grassy. I chose a big grassy. And as we see, they're loading. I mean, what is wrong with Meep City? I mean, I don't see what's wrong. Like, literally. You go into your own house, you can customize it the way you want, and it's actually a fun addiction. Hmm, and I literally wonder why it is the worst ever rated Roblox game. Anyway, that's kind of confusing. So here we got something to make. Wow. That's not bad. It's actually not bad. It's all for free. I mean, they give you things for free at the start. Like, I don't see what's wrong with Meep City. So, I don't get it. Anyway guys, let's move on. All I gotta say is that Meep City shouldn't be the 10th first rated Roblox game on Roblox. This game has loads to offer. It has a fishing lake at the park, and you can even go to the supermarket and buy yourself your own home and even customize it the way you want. Five stars. Next up, we got Area 51. Apparently, many people complain about this game. That it has terrible graphics, and I just have no idea. I never played this game in my life, but I'm doing for all of this for you guys. So you can see me ranking and experiencing the worst ever rated Roblox game in Roblox. And now we're about to find out. Alright guys, we're about to find out now. If the graphics are actually realistic or very terrible, but for now I do see a bit unrealistic graphics, but this one seems realistic. So right now we are going to go to classic mode because I'm just gonna testing test it. I'm gonna go for normal. And here we are. I'm waiting to see if the graphics are realistic. So as you can see, the funny is really funny. funny. Like when you run, it's just you know, it's really weird. Like look how legs are moving. Legs are really long. So right now, you can see that um, the graphics do not seem as improved. So this is low textured. This is fine. Uh, this is this looks amazing, but like when you go closer to it, it looks a bit unimproved. So guys, I have nothing to do in this game and. They were right, graphics are definitely not the best, and let's move on and see what I have to say about this. The graphics seem very unimpressed, and the texture is so bad. One star. Anyway guys, we're playing Mad Murder, and apparently many people complain that it's the stupid game where everyone kills each other. And we're about to find out, apparently it just spawned into some mini town where you stand there but like many people just complain it's stupid everybody kills each other i just mentioned it so i don't know what kind of game is this so they spawned me holding some orange sword like i'm kind of confused so i don't know because like this game is pretty confusing like i don't really see anyone murdering each other either murdering me to be honest so it's kind of stupid it is stupid because now i just realized that whenever someone clicks a button for spawning i just respawn into that place that the other player decided to spawn into so like this is actually stupid but it yeah yeah, that is definitely a chaos. Like, many people murder each other. Anyway, guys, let's just move on. This is kind of ridiculous. And here's what I gotta say. This game is chaos. Everyone kills each other, and I'm absolutely speechless. One star. Next up, we got the Adopt Me. Apparently, many people complain that it's a bad game for some reason. Although this game is actually pretty good, they give you tutorials what to do. And give you conclusions what to do so you can you know introduce 
to the game a bit more better. So as you can see, you can have your own pet. Um, it is a bit annoying when those things keep coming and annoy you. I'm not really interested. I'm just testing the game to show you guys the reasons and conclusions why this game is so bad. As people say, apparently they say it's a fourth. But we're just gonna exit the home and explore more of Adopt Me. They even claim you money for free, like. Why would that be the full first game on Roblox when you literally have everything you need? Like, come on. Look at all of this. It's just amazing. It's it's really cool. And I just have nothing to say, but like it's it's a fun game. Guys, there's nothing else to say, but this game is so beautiful and so pretty. Reminds me a lot about Neep City, so yeah, let's just move on and see what I have to say about this. This game is a masterpiece. It should be on my best games top 10 list. You even get money for absolutely free each day on Adopt Me. This is fun. Oh, and did I mention five stars? Huh. Silly me. <laughs> Alright guys, last but not least, we got a game called Worst Ever Game. So like, apparently many people rate it to be the worst ever game on Roblox. And apparently there's so many weird stuff going on and this things keep popping up. And there's some weird ass mashy cardboard. I'm actually kind of weirded out. What kind of- what? What is this? Like... This is all so weird, guys. Like, what am I supposed to do in this game when everything collapsed? And no wonder why everyone says it's the worst and the most terrible game, guys. I don't think I want to even play this anymore, to be honest. It's kind of hitting me in my head and it's kind of annoying me. Like, what is this? And this thing's keep popping up and it's kind of annoying. Guys, I hate this game and I'm definitely going to give this a one star. This is the worst game ever. It has bugs, glitches, and has a weird sign popping up every single moment. One star. Anyway guys, it's me, Philip Abeski again. If you guys really enjoyed the worst ever rated games on Roblox, be sure and do not hesitate to like this video and subscribe and turn the notification bell on if you have it already. Anyway guys, See you in my next video and peace!